The cosmos is stirring, and humanity finds itself at the heart of a profound planetary and cosmic transition. This shift, though subtle in appearance, is immense in scale. For centuries, we have navigated a world bound by the limitations of the third dimension, where trials, challenges, and expiations have been a natural part of our journey. But now, something far greater is awakening. The energies of our planet are shifting, and with it, so are we. People everywhere are feeling this change. Perhaps you've noticed it too, those inexplicable physical sensations, emotional surges, or even spiritual restlessness. These are not random. They are the whispers of a deeper transformation, one that is happening at both the individual and collective level. Our very cells, our DNA, are being restructured to align with the higher frequencies that are now bathing the Earth. Our DNA, once limited to its human form, is beginning to evolve into something much more expansive, something galactic. As the energies of the cosmos pour into our world, we are being prepared for a new way of being. This transformation is not just symbolic, it's tangible. Humanity's DNA is moving beyond its terrestrial blueprint, shifting towards a structure that connects us to the greater cosmic family, the Galactic Federation. This is a sign that our planet, once a world of trials, is transitioning into a world of regeneration, a world where the old systems and patterns of suffering no longer serve us. Yet, these changes, while exciting, also come with challenges. The body, the mind, and the soul are all being recalibrated to resonate with these new frequencies. Some may experience discomfort, physical symptoms, emotional upheavals, spiritual confusion, but these are signs that we are adjusting, that we are shedding the limitations of the old world to embrace a higher state of consciousness. We are, quite literally, being rewired. Our planet is ascending, and we are ascending with it. The transition may feel uncertain at times, as the old systems crumble and the new begins to take shape. But rest assured, this is the beginning of a new era, a time when humanity is being called to step into its true potential, to reconnect with its cosmic origins, and to embrace the regenerative energies of the fifth dimension. This is not merely a spiritual evolution, it is a cosmic realignment. We are being invited to leave behind the dense, restrictive energies of the past and to enter a state of higher vibrational living. The symptoms we experience now are part of the process, necessary adjustments as we prepare to embody a new level of consciousness, a state of unity, love, and harmony that awaits on the other side of this transition. The great shift is happening now. It is subtle, yet profound. And as we allow ourselves to flow with these changes, we align with the grander cosmic plan, one that is leading us to a world far more beautiful, far more expansive, than we can currently imagine. The Earth, as we know it, is undergoing a profound transformation. No longer confined to the dense energies of the third dimension, our planet is ascending, moving toward the frequencies of the fifth dimension and beyond. This journey of ascension is not just Earth's path, but also humanities. We, too, must evolve alongside our planet, stepping into a higher state of consciousness that transcends the limitations of the old world. In the third dimension, we have been bound by systems rooted in fear, control, and separation, structures that, for so long, dictated how we lived and how we perceived reality. These systems have shaped our beliefs, our actions, and even the way we understand ourselves and the universe. But as Earth rises into higher frequencies, these outdated systems are beginning to crumble. They can no longer sustain themselves in the new energetic reality that is unfolding. For humanity, this means letting go of the beliefs that no longer serve us, beliefs that have kept us tethered to fear, division, and lack. The ascension process calls us to release the limitations of the past, to surrender the old ways of thinking, and to open ourselves to the limitless possibilities that exist in higher dimensions. It is a process of shedding, of unlearning what we thought we knew, so that we can embrace the truth of who we really are, beings of light, connected to the divine, part of the vast cosmic tapestry. Yet, 
As with any great transformation, this shift is not without its challenges. Many are feeling the discomfort of this energetic shift, physical symptoms, emotional turbulence, and spiritual confusion. This discomfort often stems from resistance, the natural human tendency to cling to what is familiar, even when it no longer serves us. The old ways may feel safe because they are known, but they are no longer aligned with the new earth that is being born. To ascend with the earth, we must be willing to cross the dimensional bridge. This bridge represents the gap between the old world and the new, between the third dimension and the higher realms. Crossing it requires a willingness to step into the unknown, to trust that what awaits on the other side is far more expansive and filled with light. It requires us to move beyond our comfort zones, to embrace change, and to realign ourselves with the higher frequencies of love, compassion, and unity that define the fifth dimension. Resistance only makes this journey more difficult. It creates blockages, both within our energy bodies and within our minds manifesting as physical and emotional symptoms. The more we resist, the more we struggle. But the moment we allow ourselves to surrender, to flow with the currents of this cosmic shift, we open ourselves to the ease and grace that the higher dimensions offer. This ascension is not something to fear. It is a return to our true essence. It is an invitation to step fully into our divine nature, to become co-creators of the new earth, where harmony, unity, and love reign supreme. The path forward is clear, but it is up to each of us to make the choice, to release the old, to cross the bridge, and to rise with the earth into the light of the fifth dimension and beyond. This is a time of great opportunity, a time to let go of the illusions that have kept us small and to embrace the vastness of our potential. The dimensional shift is here, and it beckons us to step into our highest selves, the only question is, are we ready to take that step? As the Earth ascends into higher frequencies, many are feeling the effects of this profound transformation within their own bodies, minds, and spirits. These symptoms, whether physical discomfort, emotional upheavals, or spiritual confusion, are not random, they are the natural byproducts of our energetic adjustment. The frequencies of the planet are shifting, and so too must our own energy fields, as we align with the new vibrations that are sweeping through the Earth. For some, the sensations may be subtle, a persistent feeling of restlessness, fatigue, or perhaps even vivid dreams that seem to carry deeper meanings. For others, the symptoms may be more pronounced, physical aches, emotional swings, or a sense of disconnection from reality. These experiences are not signs of something wrong, but rather, signs that our bodies and souls are adapting to the new energetic landscape. Part of this process is a natural cleansing, a purging of old energies, beliefs, and karmic imprints that no longer serve us in this new phase of existence. As we ascend, we are being called to release the baggage of the third dimension, the fear, the limitations, the unresolved emotions. This cleansing can manifest as emotional distress or physical discomfort, as the soul clears out these old energies to make space for the higher frequencies. However, not all symptoms stem from this cleansing process. Some arise from resistance, the human tendency to hold on to what is familiar, even when it causes suffering. Resistance to these shifts creates energetic blockages, which can result in intensified symptoms. The more we cling to the old ways of being, the more difficult the adjustment becomes. But when we surrender to the flow of these new energies, the process becomes smoother and the symptoms ease. Yet, these personal adjustments are not happening in isolation. We are deeply connected to the energies of the cosmos, and right now, powerful cosmic forces are at play. The Sun, our closest celestial ally, is sending waves of energetic pulses in the form of coronal mass ejections CMEs. These solar flares are not just spectacular astronomical events, they are surges of energy that directly impact the Earth's electromagnetic field, and by extension, our own. As these CMEs strike the Earth, they bring with them intense bursts of energy that accelerate the planet's vibrational shifts. 
the Schumann resonance, Earth's natural frequency, has risen dramatically in recent years. Once stable at around 7.83 Hz for decades, it is now spiking to unprecedented levels, often exceeding 50 Hz and beyond. These fluctuations are clear signals that the Earth's energetic frequency is rising, and we, as part of this planet, are being called to rise with it. The effects of these solar and galactic influences are profound. Each CME acts like a pulse of energy, an infusion of light that triggers shifts not only in the Earth's energy grid, but also within each of us. The fluctuations in the Schumann resonance often correspond with spikes in symptoms, physical, emotional, and mental, as our bodies struggle to adapt to these new, higher frequencies. This is not a time to fear or resist these changes, but rather to embrace them. The cosmic energies are here to support our evolution, to help us align with the new Earth that is being born. Every pulse from the Sun, every surge in the Schumann resonance, is a reminder that we are in the midst of a grand cosmic dance, a dance that is guiding us towards greater harmony, higher consciousness, and deeper connection with the universe. The symptoms we experience, though uncomfortable at times, are simply the signs of this transformation unfolding within us. By understanding these influences and surrendering to the flow of cosmic energy, we can move through this process with greater ease, knowing that we are being energetically upgraded to step into our highest potential. In this sacred transition, the discomfort is temporary, but the rewards are eternal, an expanded consciousness, a more profound connection to the cosmos, and the ability to live in harmony with the higher frequencies of the new Earth. At the deepest level of our being, the soul knows that the time for change has arrived. This inner knowing transcends the conscious mind's hesitations or resistance. The process of ascension, though often misunderstood, is not about intellectual knowledge or gathering facts. It is about aligning with the pure frequency of the soul, the part of us that is always connected to the divine, to the greater cosmic flow. The soul feels the call to rise, even when the mind clings to the familiar. It understands that this moment, this profound shift into the higher dimensions, has been foretold, and it carries the readiness for this transition deep within its essence. Ascension is not a journey of logic or reason, it is a vibrational path. Those whose souls resonate with love, compassion, and unity are naturally attuned to the new frequencies of the Earth as she ascends into the fifth dimension and beyond. It is not about perfection or having all the answers. It is about the purity of the heart, the intention to live in alignment with the higher principles of love and harmony. Souls who vibrate with these frequencies, regardless of their knowledge or worldly status, will ascend into the new Earth. It is a process of energetic resonance, those who carry the light within will naturally be drawn to the light of the new reality. But this transformation does not happen without support. In this grand cosmic unfolding, spiritual protection is all around us. No soul is left to journey alone. Whether we recognize it or not, we are all enveloped by a divine protection, guided and supported by forces that transcend our everyday understanding. This protection is woven into the fabric of the universe, a safety net that ensures the soul's path is honored and guided, no matter the challenges faced along the way. Yet, as with any great shift, there are opposing forces, energies that resist the light, that seek to hold on to the old ways. These forces, however, are part of the divine dance. Even in their opposition, they serve the greater purpose, as they bring into focus the contrast that makes the light shine even brighter. The divine plan, in its infinite wisdom, has already ensured the victory of light. The shadows may try to disrupt the process, but they cannot stop what is divinely ordained. In this cosmic shift, no soul is abandoned, and no challenge is without purpose. The light will always prevail, as it is the very essence of creation. The divine plan is unfolding perfectly, even when the path appears uncertain. Trust that this spiritual protection surrounds us all, ensuring that the soul's journey toward ascension is guided, safeguarded, and supported by the highest forces of love. 
As the earth ascends, so too will those who are ready, their hearts pure and aligned with the vibration of love. This is the destiny of humanity, the realization of our true potential, as we step into the higher dimensions of existence. It is not a matter of if, but when. The soul is ready, and the time is now. All that remains is to trust the journey, to release the fear, and to embrace the light of the new earth that awaits us. At the core of this cosmic transition lies one of the greatest gifts humanity has been bestowed, free will. Every soul is given the freedom to choose how it will navigate this monumental shift. The energies of ascension are available to all, but the decision to embrace these new frequencies or remain in the comfort of the old vibrations is entirely personal. No one is forced into ascension, and no one is left behind against their will. It is the soul's sovereign choice, guided by its readiness and desire to evolve. For those who are aligned with love, unity, and the principles of the higher dimensions, the path of ascension is clear. They will naturally rise with the earth as she moves into the fifth dimension and beyond, their energy resonating with the new frequencies. But for others, the pull of the familiar, of the third dimensional reality, may still be strong. This is not a failure but simply part of their soul's unique journey. Those who are not yet ready to ascend will continue their evolution elsewhere, on other planets that are still in the phase of trials and learning. They will have more opportunities to grow, to expand, and when the time is right for them, they too will experience their ascension. This freedom of choice is sacred. It reflects the divine respect for each soul's journey, for each soul's timeline of awakening. There is no judgment in this process, only the recognition that every soul will ascend when it is ready, in its own perfect time. Those who are prepared will take the leap now, while others may wait for future lifetimes. Both paths are honored in the grand scheme of the cosmos. Yet, the transition itself is inevitable. The Earth is rising, and her frequencies are lifting to meet the vibrations of the fifth dimension. This process is not something that can be stopped or slowed, it is the natural evolution of the planet and all life upon it. As the energies of ascension flood the earth, it becomes essential for each of us to elevate our own personal frequencies, to align with the new energies of love, harmony, and unity. This is not just about surviving the shift, it's about thriving within it. To elevate our frequency means to release the heavy, limiting beliefs of the past, to let go of fear, control, and division, and to embrace the light that is now pouring into the earth. It requires a conscious choice to live in alignment with love, to open ourselves to the wisdom of the heart, and to cultivate compassion for ourselves and others. The fifth dimension is not a place, it is a state of being, a vibration that resonates with the highest aspects of who we are. It is a frequency of unity, where the illusion of separation dissolves, and we recognize ourselves as part of the greater whole. In this dimension, life is guided by harmony, by the flow of universal love, and by the deep understanding that we are all interconnected. Humanity is on the cusp of this ascension. The opportunity is here, now, for each soul to choose whether to rise with the earth into this new reality or to continue learning in the slower vibrations of the old world. Neither path is wrong, but the ascension is calling to those who are ready, offering the chance to step into a new way of being, a new way of living that is infused with light, peace, and joy. The choice is simple yet profound. Will you embrace the light and ascend into the higher frequencies of the new earth, or will you continue your journey in the familiar vibrations of the past? The transition is already in motion, and as the energies of ascension build, it is up to each of us to align our frequencies with the new earth and rise with her into the next stage of our collective evolution. This is a journey of the heart, a journey that calls us to awaken to our true nature and to step fully into the love, compassion, and unity that define the higher dimensions. The time is now, and the path is before us. It is a path of light, of transformation, and of ascension.